my autumn decor, which pretty much I treat like late summer decor because it's still officially summer here. So uh, we still tend to get high temps and I still don't want to go full blown fall, but I don't want the summer decorations up anymore either. So this is like my meat in the middle. I put this up for a couple of weeks, well, a few weeks, and then I shift into Halloween and then that's when I go into my fall. I don't have a lot, um, but we are going to put up what I do have. I don't even know what direction I'm going. I want to change up the table. It's my late summer decor, even though I just said late summer. I actually decorated quite late this year for summer, so I went more of a subtle summer than the, you know, pop red, white, and blue. Uh, but I want to get rid of it. It's got lemons and strawberries, so I want to take that out and introduce, like, apples and sunflowers. But at the same time, I don't... Let me get that phone. Okay. <laughs> I have no idea what I was in the middle of saying, but um, I think I was talking about my table. So I have no idea in what direction I'm going to go in. Um, I don't have a lot of big pieces that I could make up the tablescape. So, hmm, I don't know. We'll see. Um, I'm just, like I said, going to get rid of the lemons, get rid of the strawberries, add my sunflowers and apples, and hopefully it'll be enough. I've got some of this stuff out. So far, I decided to keep the yellow flowers. They're a little lighter than the sunflower yellow, but it's all I have, so I'm gonna make it work. And what I did, which I wasn't um, counting on using them, but I'm really liking the uh, shape that it's going in, so I, I think I'm, I'm gonna roll with it. So I had my Independence Bell kind of just sitting off to the side here. I removed it. We'll do a close up, uh, but for right now, I'm just gonna get everything together. And I ended up adding these gourds, which of course is a very full, but they're not actually like pumpkins and there's yellows and greens. So I think it's perfect for that autumn look that I wanna create. So I I think I am going to remove these baskets. I was thinking maybe of keeping them at least throughout until I switch to Halloween. But I am thinking now that I am going to get rid of them. And I did plan all along to use this basket, but I was thinking of maybe just taking the apples and adding it here. But I'm not really vibing with the apple and gourd. So I might just mix the apples all together this season and instead do like gourd and sunflowers. But let's continue on and see what I end up with for my final autumn look. I love where this went. This is one of my favorite things about decorating is you can have a whole plan, but like once you start, 
it like takes a life of its own and it just builds on each other and a lot of times or at least I end up with a totally different decor look than what I originally planned and this is a proof right here so I definitely wanted to continue it on this side so I brought up my terracotta pot I added some Spanish more and I put another gourd and now I brought that fuzzy feel onto the side. I also brought back my napkin holder. I took it away, I think fall of last year, if I'm not mistaken. And I have not put it back since and I have really missed it. I've always loved having table napkins on the table, but I took it away that one way I ended up going and just kept changing out, but the table napkins never seemed to fit back in. I'm very happy to say, ta-ta, it's back. And it goes perfectly with the fussy browns also. I really did want to use those other, uh, I don't know what you want to call them, like bases, those uh, iron, black iron bases too. I really loved that earthy look that that gave me, but it definitely wasn't going to work, so this kind of replaces it. Now I'm going to add my candles, and then I will grab the napkin, and the table should be done. We'll pretend the watermelon isn't there, although the color matches perfectly, but that's where it's living until we cut it up. Over by the hutch, the only addition that I did was some small gourds. 